I'm singing a song, and I don't know why, so I'm just singing a song. Da, 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 da. Well, uh, Titanosaurus, I got the mail. <gasps> Here's the mail, it never fails, it makes me want to wag my tail, and when it comes, I just want to shout, MAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAAA
<laughs> oh yeah, I'm actually going to the party. All right, I knew Mechagodzilla wouldn't let me down. Uh, all right, now I need to get ready. Uh, oh, come on, why is there anything for me to get dressed in? All right, oh, come on, there's gotta be something to... They left without me, didn't they? I should have guessed. Oh, stupid Mechagodzilla and Nala ditching me all by myself just to go to Godzilla's party. Godzilla is such a jerk, I don't understand why everybody in the world loves him. And now, what am I supposed to do? I can't go to that party because I'm just a one-time monster. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, an idea is hatching. I'm not the only one-time monster. Or there's several other monsters that haven't gotten another, another appearance in a Godzilla movie. Oy, and together, we could share our hatred for Godzilla. Because togetherness, we are empowered. I gotta give him a call. <laughs> Alright, I need to give him a call. Oh, come on, guys, pick up. Oh, come on, pick up. Hey, guys, it's Titanosaurus, remember me? <sighs> of course you don't. Uh, listen, guys, have you heard that, that Godzilla was holding a party tonight? Uh, yeah, but he only invited monsters that have appeared more than once in his movies. Yeah, I know, it's ridiculous, right? <sighs> so that's why I'm holding a new club. It's called the Rejects Club. Can you guys make it? Guys, guys, you only had that one job, and you never appeared in another movie. You need to be at this club so we can share our hatred for Godzilla. <sighs> what if I told you we had cookies? Oh, great. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the first meeting of the Rejects Club. Um, Titanosaurus, uh, the only reason I came was because you promised cookies. Yeah, because you said that there were cookies. Guys, the cookies are not the point. The whole reason we're here is to explain why we got screwed by Godzilla in some sort of way. Oh yeah, that's right. That's why you wanted us to come here in the first place. At least I only came here was because you did have food. Yeah, uh, I came here for food too. Because, uh, I, I haven't eaten in, like, a week or so. Okay, we're getting off subject. Okay, listen, I'm gonna start. Now, first, we are gonna, we're gonna explain what movie we came from, and then we're gonna explain our lives afterward. Alright, so I'll start. So, hi, my name is Titanosaurus, and the movie I only appeared in was Terror of Mechagodzilla. And, uh, I was, frankly, Mechagodzilla's sidekick. And, uh... Well, I mean, it was a pretty good movie, I mean, despite uh, uh, being the one of the lowest-grossing lowest mo Godzilla movies ever. And I don't understand. It's a really good movie. And uh, after that, that Toho pretty much said, Nope, you're not a cool enough monster. Get out on the street. <sighs> but I was adored by so many fans, and probably so many fans wanted to see me in another movie. But nope. I was thrown out on the street begging for money. And every year, I would see Godzilla's face up on the, the big screens in downtown Tokyo. Oh, seeing his fame and success grow and grow. And I get so angry knowing that he's so popular. And I just kept begging for money out on the street, trying to survive. Just like, spare change! Spare change, ma'am! And then, one day, I ended up in a packaging factory because it was a little too cold outside. And uh, I was sleeping in a box, and then uh, uh, the factory opened, and uh, I accidentally got myself packaged into a box, and which then I was shipped off to North America, and then and I met this this kid who goes by the name Retro Reject, and uh, I live at his house now, and a little bit after that he uh, the kid ordered Mechagodzilla, and then we then me and Mechagodzilla met met, and then. And we pretty much became friends ever since. And we've been living at this house for uh, the past couple of years now. I mean, it's an alright life, but it could be so much better. Because I'm a cool monster. I don't deserve to be a one-time monster. I need to be in another movie. Well, you are one sad, strange little monster. Yeah, that's pretty pathetic, man. Yeah, I've seen much worse. 
Oh, come on, it's still a tragic life. Uh, well, I would like to see you guys try better. Yes, I'll gladly do better. So, hi, my name is King Caesar, and I appeared in Godzilla vs. Mechagodzilla. And, I mean, it, once again, it was a pretty good movie. I mean, not that, not, not bad, but still good. And, well, like Titanosaurus, uh, Toho pretty much said, said, uh, nope, you're not a popular enough monster, get the heck out of here. Yeah, but, for Pete's sake, I helped Godzilla defeat Mechagodzilla in that movie. I mean, doesn't that deserve some kind of popularity? <sighs> so anyway, I didn't take to their response lately. So, I moved to New York, and that's where I got my accent. And... Uh, for a while in New York, I started to run a little pizza place. Was it Little Caesars by any chance? No! <laughs> yes. Oh, Little Caesars is terrible! Yeah, it truly is. But I'd still eat it. Pizza's fuel for the soul. Oh, shut up, you guys. I'm still talking here. Alright, so... Uh, for a while, I did run Little Caesars for a while, but then I got fired because, uh, they found hair in the pizza. But it's not my fault. I'm basically a giant dog. Well, it's not my fault that I shed. So anyway, after that, I was pretty much, much done. I lost my apartment, and that was bad. So then, moved down to Florida because... Hey, I'm like pretty much over a thousand years old, so I'm definitely good for retirement. So, yeah, I've been pretty much living off the government's money. That was definitely a more interesting story. Hey, I can hear you. Alright, so now it's my turn. So, hi, I'm Space Godzilla. Wait a minute, you're Godzilla's brother? Yeah, but being the brother of the King of the Monsters, yeah, it doesn't do any help for you. So anyway, I appeared in Godzilla vs. Space Godzilla. I mean, it's kind of weird that I had to fight my brother, but hey, at least I still got paid. Aid, but um, after a while, my money started to run out from my movie. So uh, obviously, I went to Godzilla and it's like, um, hey man, could you uh, could you just spare me a little bit of money so I can uh, make a living? And uh, Godzilla was like, uh, heck no, you're not gonna mooch off my success. So uh, he told me to leave. Yeah, and I, I mean, I didn't have any luck of uh, trying to find new work. Work, uh, so I'm now living with Biolanti because um, we're technically brother and sister. Wait, wait a minute, you guys are brother and sister or two Godzilla? Like, how is that possible? You guys look nothing like him. Um, uh, well, maybe a little bit, but you guys don't look like Godzilla. Plant DNA was fused with Godzilla's cells, uh, so that's why I exist. And uh, for Space Godzilla, it's almost the same, except it was just probably something from outer space. So, um, I guess it's my turn now. So, so hi, I'm Biolanti, and um, of course I come from the movie Godzilla vs. Biolanti. And so, once again, kind of like Space Godzilla, uh, I did get money from, from working at Toho, and then it started to run out, so... I decided to open a, a plant shop. Shop. I mean, it's still a thriving business, but I mean, it could be better. In fact, I tried to get money from Godzilla to help me improve it, but of course, like Space Godzilla, it's like, oh heck no, I'm not gonna give you any money, you little plant freak. Eh. But I mean, it's still good. And so, and sometimes it does get lonely whenever Space Godzilla isn't around, but. That's why I have these guys. Yeah, babe, we're always gonna be there for you. Yeah, whenever you need us. That is trippy, bro. Wait, guys, uh, do you hear that? But hear what? Uh, oh, 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 man. Oh, <laughs> uh, sorry, I'm late, guys. What, what the? Jet Jaguar? Oh yeah. Uh, my brother told me everything about you. You were uh, in Godzilla vs. Megalon, right? Yeah, that's right. Right, I did come from Godzilla vs. Megalon. Oh, and so, uh, uh, sorry I was late, guys. Uh, uh, just me flying over from Tokyo. I mean, it, it's a it's a long flight. Well, better late than never. All right, Jet Jaguar, tell us your story. What have you been up to? Well, thank you, Titanosaurus. All right, so as Gigan said, I came from Godzilla vs. Megalon, 
and uh, I was first a drawing for a Toho Kids, uh, you know, drawing contest, as and of course my entry won to be in that movie. Of course, originally I was supposed to be the main hero of that movie, but then I was upstaged by Godzilla, and so after that. Uh, so after the movie, uh, I went back to the kid. I mean, that was cool for a while. We had a bit of, bit of fun together. Uh, but then after that, he started to get a little bit bored of me. And then he replaced me with Ultraman. And darn it, Ultraman. He's like the upgrade version of me. And I don't get it. I'm so much better in many ways. So after that, I pretty much just roamed the streets of Tokyo. Tokyo, just a... Uh, doing like robot dances you know because uh nothing gets money like uh, doing robot dances right because <laughs> uh, i mean i'm not lame guys i'm cool right right <sighs> oh you guys are so lucky to have friends at least at least uh, i'm all by myself all i have is my brother uh, he's more popular though <sighs> i came from a godzilla final wars which, I mean, in hindsight, it's probably the only movie I be I'll ever appear in. I mean, because, I mean, look at me. Um, but why would you pass down this? I look so cool. You look more edgy than cool. Yeah, totally edgy, man. 100% edgy. So edgy that knives will cry. Well, yeah, but uh, edgy can be cool, uh, right, uh, guys? Uh, well, um, yeah, you are edgy. You see, guys, that's why I started this club. We need to find a way to bring ourselves back into the spotlight. Like, so many of us only got that one chance of fame, but now we need to do something about it. Titanosaurus, you're right. We need to do something about it. I know what to do. We need to do an act of violence. Um, actually, I was just thinking that we should uh, ask Toho to put us in a new movie by uh, writing a polite letter. King Caesar has a point. Wait, but what kind of act of violence could we do? Um, uh, wait a minute. We could beat somebody up. Yeah, we need to beat up a monster that has appeared more than many times in a movie. Yeah, uh, Space Godzilla's right. But which one should we beat up? Uh, oh, I know, babe. We should beat up Mecha Godzilla. Oh, that's a great idea. What? No, not Mecha Godzilla. He's my friend. I'm in favor of that one. Come on, let's get ready. He's probably going to be home any minute now. Right with you, Gigan. Yeah, boy, I'll get the rope. Yeah, guys, I'm ready to do this. Yeah, I should be the only cool robot in the Godzilla franchise. I mean, because I'm cool, right, guys? Guys? Ah, ah, oh well. What? No, guys, this isn't what I meant! Oh, oh man, oh Nala, that was some party, wasn't it? Yeah, it definitely was a fun party. Right, uh, but I do still feel bad about uh, leaving Titanosaurus behind. I know, I'm, you know, I'm gonna go check on him. I hope he's not too mad at me. Oh, don't worry, Godzilla. Titanosaurus is not that violent of a guy. Uh, what's the worst he's gonna do? <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess you're right. Well, um, also, if you excuse me, I'm gonna w go spy on the retro reject while he sleeps. Uh, Nala, you know he doesn't like you, and uh, what are you going to do if he catches you? Oh, don't worry. I, I'll be really quiet. And besides, I like guys who who like to play hard to get. Um, okay, you go do that. Uh, man, that was some party. Uh, uh, Titanosaurus, uh, where are you? Titanosaurus. No, 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 what the frick, man? I'm broken in rage, dude. No, no, you get him. All right, boys. All right, now that we have Mechagodzilla tied up, let's enact our events for just being one-time monsters. What What are you guys doing? One-time monsters? Wait. Oh, right. You, you guys were one-time monsters. Yeah. Now... Now let's enact our revenge. What? Oh, why on me? I didn't do anything to you. You've been in many movies, Mechagodzilla. What well, now? Oh, that's why we're attacking you. All right. So endure the pain, Mechagodzilla. Wait, what? Ow! Ow! Oh, what the heck was that? It was a punch, dweeb. Ow! Oh, oh God! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Ow! 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 <laughs> All right, Bylanti, your turn. Oh, jeez.
Oh, oh, man. I mean, uh, all right, Mechagodzilla. Now, prepare to meet my friends. What, your friends? Friends? Yeah, boy. We're gonna, we're gonna kick your butt. What, well, yeah, so intolerate your pain, Mechagodzilla. Okay, am I tripping out right now? Ow! Oh, man, that hurt! Ow, oh, take that, dude! Oh, now, my turn. No, 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 the violent. Oh, no, man, that's a oh, <laughs> Alright, King Caesar, your turn. Alright, wait, King Caesar! <laughs> oh, yeah, Mech Godzilla, you surprised to see me? Uh, yeah? Uh, are, are you gonna be friendly to me this time? No. Do you really think I'm gonna be that friendly to you, dude? Or right, now, endure your pain. Oh, come on, please stop. Ow! Ow! Stop it! Ow! No, great. Your ropes are getting undone. Oh, no, oh, gosh, please. Just stop, King Caesar. All right, nope. Just one more. Ow! 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 Oh. Oh, all right, guy again, your turn. <laughs> all right, Mechagodzilla, I'm gonna show you what a real robot can do. Well, we're both robots. Well, I'm the cooler robot. <laughs> ow! 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 <laughs> all right, Mechagodzilla, I know exactly what your worst pain is gonna be. Oh, come on, please, it can't be worse than what they did to me. Oh, no. It is gonna be worse. And I know exactly what I'm gonna do. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna decapitate you. What? No, 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 please. I've already been decapitated in two movies. Please don't do it again. It's too late for that, Matt Godzilla. No, no, please, no! <laughs> oh, no! You guys killed Mecha Godzilla! But, dude, isn't this what you wanted? Uh, yeah, we just sent a message to Toho. We're no longer going to stick with being the side characters anymore. Just being in one movie. Yeah, because it's our time to shine now. Now, yeah, because we're cool. Uh, right, guys? No, this is not the complete exact opposite of what I wanted. I just wanted all of us to share our hatred for Godzilla for just being in one movie. But this has gone too far. Violent actions only lead to worse things. The only true power there is, is in words. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna blow you away with my dance moves. <laughs> yeah, like that's gonna work. Uh, 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 oh no, what's going on? Ah, uh, uh, he's too strong. Ah, uh, uh, his dance moves are too impressive. Ah, ah. I never experienced something like this in Brooklyn. Ah! Uh, uh, at least I'm still cool, guys. Ah! Uh, yeah, so long, losers. <laughs> uh, well, now that's it. That's over with. Well, I better get to repairing my Godzilla. All right, come here, head. Uh, uh, well, my Godzilla, uh, you're all better now. You're probably still mad at me for, uh, yes! Yes, I am! <sighs> Listen, Mechagodzilla, um, how was the party? Pretty fang sweet. Until you got a bunch of one-time monsters to decapitate my head. <sighs> Listen, Mechagodzilla, I'm sorry. Yeah, you should be. <sighs> I mean, Mechagodzilla, you, you don't understand. I mean, I don't like being a one-time monster. It's so stupid. When I just wanted to have one more chance at fame. Listen, Titanosaurus, there's nothing to be ashamed of of being a one-time monster. I mean, I like you just the way you are, in your crazy way. Thanks, Mechagodzilla. No problem. So, um, did they believe that you and Nala were a couple? No. No, they didn't. Ah, that's too bad. Uh, hey guys. Oh, hey Nala. Um, how was your spying on the Retro Reject? Wait, wait, what? Uh, yeah, she spies on the Retro Reject while he sleeps. Uh, okay. Oh, uh, well, it was fine and until he caught me. Uh, well, that figures. Uh. Say, Nala. Um, do you want to go out on a date with me? Well, Titanosaurus? No. Rejected again.